All right, folks, welcome to That's Fishing with Captain Shane. I got my buddy, Captain Jim Walsh, on the board, my oldest and dearest friend, uh, friend in Florida. I'm on vacation. And me and Jim had planned months ago to, to both be free. We're going to come up here and do a little fishing. So today we're peacock fishing. You guys stay tuned. It's going to be awesome. It's a little bit of a live bait trip, but I'm going to tell you, to be honest with you, we've already done it. Jim catches a whale. Stay tuned. It's going to be freaking phenomenal. All right, guys, right quick, I'm going to show you how we're going to rig up for these peacock today. First thing I'm going to do is use a 20-pound fluorocarbon leader. Some guys use a smaller leader, 15-pound, 12-pound, 10-pound. It doesn't really matter. But uh, first thing I'm going to do is tie a little overhand knot. And um, I'm using a Mustad uh, 1 -oh fine wire live bait hook. Go ahead and hook that, run that up. I'm going to tie this real quick. I'm not really trying to show you how to tie the knot, but I definitely want to have some sort of loop knot to where the... Uh, hook could swing a little bit. Then I'm going to take a BB uh, split shot, put it on there. Boom. A little split shot helps keep the keep the shiner down. If you just flip it in there without the without the split shot, it's going to stay on the surface, which is not bad at times, but sometimes today, uh, sometimes uh, well, I want to get it down to where the peacocks are at. That's how we do it. So anyway, get you some moose dad, one O's, number ones, two or two O's, and uh, get you some fluorocarbon leader, and some light braid, man, you're good to go, all right? There's a smart peacock that lives over there and he stays there. Never been able to catch him though. Ever. Got him this time though. Yes. Yeah, nice one. Nice one. Yeah. Awesome. It's got one too, I can't do it. Nice one, Sam. Oh yeah, lunker dog. <laughs> yeah, baby. Phil Susan's sitting there. I feed him. Bunker, he ain't eating nothing. He stays full. It's okay. It's okay. Did you lose him? Yes. Oh. Okay. It's okay. Trust me. Trust me. It's not a big deal. We got him. I let him jump too much. I shouldn't have that. That's all right. That was cool, man. Uh, Fight, the fight's half the battle. Man, I saw him take it too. I didn't see him. I saw the lion jump. Right. Dude, we got a beast on. We got a beast. Oh, he ain't come up, baby. Stay it's up, okay. Please. Oh, yeah, he's a beast. Look at the size of him. Oh, oh I know, God. man. I know. Stay over there. Jim, you want to come back to the front oh, right geez. quick? Are you good? Oh, my God. Come on. Come. I don't want to bust. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come back up front, John. Just come back here. Just stay right here. Come, come over here. Come over here. Come on, Jim. Get on that. Stay on the fish. Stay on the fish. I am. I got the net coming. Oh my God! Please, let him stay on. Please stay. Please stay. Keep his head down. You ready? I'm gonna bring him to you. Easy. I am. Here he comes. Get his, get his head up, baby. Jim, come up front, please. Come up front. Come up front. Oh my goodness, Jim! You deal with that thing. Oh my God, Shane. I know. Oh my God, Shane. I know. Oh my God. I told you, dude. With that, oh we. Pick him up, Jim. Pick him up, Jim. Pick him up. Pick him up. I'm, I'm fixing to do surgery. Oh my goodness, look at that guys. Oh That's about a seven god. pounder. Seven pounds, easy. Oh my. Oh my god, look <laughs> All right, brother. Oh, 
Come up front. Come up front. <laughs> That's a big fish, Jeff. Yeah. That's a big fish, Jeff. Yeah. Jim, hold him up for this camera one time. Hold him up for this camera. Come on, Jim. Hold him up for this camera. There you go. Boom. Good fish. Good. Alright guys, thanks for watching man, and what an awesome trip. Jim, pleasure. Thank you Shane, Captain Shane. Always a pleasure fishing with Captain Jim. You know, I've known Jim for probably 31 Jim, years, something, 32. Jim. We used to room together, work construction and stuff like that. Jim's an awesome dude, but anyway, it was, it was good to have Jim down. What did you think about Jim's fish? Was that a freaking phenomenal fish or what? That was one of the bigger fish that, that we've awesome. caught since I've been peacock guiding. Fish of a lifetime for me. It was fish of a lifetime. Anyway, thanks for watching. Guys, look here, November 11th through the 18th of this year, I'm going to the Amazon. I need a few more guys to go. If you guys want to go catch Peacock, throw in the big top water plugs down in the Rio Negro down in Brazil, give me a call. Shoot me an email. Send me a direct message or whatever. We'll go down there and have a blast. We're just going to be eight of us on the ship plus the crew. There'll be two of us to a boat. We're going to fish six and a half days, November 11th through the 18th. You guys give me a shout, man. I'd love to have you all down there, all right? I appreciate you all watching. Jim, thank you again. Thank you, Captain Shane. Captain Shane out.